Cam test for Listeria monocytogenes and Listeria ivanovii. General, the Cam test serves as a differentiation tool among hemolytic Listeria species. To conduct this test, a beta hemolysis producing Staphylococcus aureus, ATCC 25923, strain and Rhodococcus equi are streaked parallel to one another on a blood agar plate. Suspected cultures are then streaked perpendicularly between, but without touching, these two streaks L monocytogenes, and to a lesser extent L C ligeri, show enhanced hemolysis near S aureus, while L Ivanovi I exhibits increased hemolysis close to the R equi streak. It's worth noting that the CAMP test's reliability has its limitations. History The CAMP factor reaction was first documented in 1944 by Christie. Atkins, and Munch Peterson. CAMP is an acronym derived from the names of the scientists who first described the phenomenon. It refers to the synergistic lysis of erythrocytes caused by the combination of Staphylococcus aureus beta hemolysin and the extracellular CFP protein of Streptococcus agalaxiae. Poem on CAMP On blood agar stage, a bacterial play, CAMP test unfolds, Listeria's ballet. Steph aureus and Rhodococcus equi, parallel streaks, a microbial decree, perpendicular dance, the Listeria strain, hemolysis patterns, their lineage proclaim, near aureus's embrace, monocytogenes thrives, see literary 2, where golden hemolysis arrives, but Ivanovii, near equi finds its grace, enhanced hemolysis, a different space, Cam's history whispers, 1944's decree, Christie, Atkins, Munch Peterson's Legacy, Synergistic Lysis, A Cellular Art, Beta Hemolysin and CFB play their part. So let the camp test its secrets unveil, Listeria's dance, where patterns never fail.